Okay, here is uh, another uh, uh, example to show how the spectral sensor can be used uh, in real life. Here is, uh, is a real demo. This is a 64 channel uh, spectral sensor for the uh, infrared uh, range. So here is uh, what we would do. You see here is uh, three cards and two are blue, uh, one is green. Actually those two cards, if you touch it, it's a similar texture and actually both of them are kind of hard from, you know, it's hard to bend, right? And this one is a very soft, it's a very thin, and though it's a blue, and you may think, you know, those two are the same, use the same material, this is not. So this, this way of spectral sensor can help you to identify, you know, one of them is really different from the other two. So let's do this. So first, let's measure the spectral of this soft one. Okay, you see that's the spectral of the first one, and then we do the second one. Okay, so these two are for those two blue, and I'll do one more time for the green one. So you will see that you know from the screen actually this one the first the first time and the third time measurement have the same spectral response though the gain is different but the shape and the, the characteristic is the same the second one actually this dark one is not dif not the same so those two though you know from the you know the texture and from the hardness and it's totally different but actually the spectral response is totally the same so this one is not okay so that's a you know where a spectral sensor can be used in our real life for some material analysis and identification